USC looked pretty good. I was impressed with USC, and I was very impressed with Notre Dame. White going deep. What a catch! Great throw. Miles down to the 40-yard line. That's right. He had 53 yards in the last drive. Here's Matt White. Bounces outside. Nice shot. It's there. He's on his way. Warner catches him. Just outside the 10. White got on day. Man, man, touchdown! Brandon Miles. Once again, out of the shotgun. Snap comes back. White rolls the pocket. In trouble. He'll throw down field. The pass is caught. Hauled in. Three left and two out to the short side. Snap back. White steps up. Pat White's going to run. He turns on the Jets to the 20. First down 15 and takes it down inside the 15 to the 11. Blitz comes. Quarterback keep. White has the first down the sideline to the 10 to the 5. He takes it down to the 3. Owen Schmidt. Out of the gun. Here's the snap. Pat White rolling the pocket to the left. Throws in the end zone. Pass caught. Two-point conversion. Good to Darrell Jallo. Almost 12 minutes still in the first half. As Slayton reverses field. Here's his speed on display. Oh, the player gets a block. And turns what might have been a loss of five into a gain of three. And who threw it? His quarterback, Pat White. <laughs> A block of the year, maybe, for West Virginia. Did you hear the fans, the stands? <laughs> hey, Holly, that's called flipping the switch right there. White forced to scramble. Chased by Randall Fuller. He will turn it up the field and score. No gain on first down. White rolling, keeping, scored the last one with his legs and gets this one too. You're able to make that first step. You realize how important technique is when you're trying to cover somebody. White, deep, Brandon Miles. Ten freshmen on the 22-man defensive two deep for the Bearcats. They've gotten a little bit better every week. Quarterback draw, White out in space where he is most dangerous. Cincinnati hopes to keep nine in the box as often as possible tonight as again White forced to scramble runs out of room pulls up fires and the pass is brought in by Brandon Miles after Antoine Horton thought he had defense it at its Mountaineers averaging almost six yards per play White turns it upfield in a foot race track down at the 41 of the Bearcats back to play now and a second down and six for West Virginia White rolling left, and has a man, Miles inside the five, first and goal. Makes up for it by causing the fumble. White, all the way on the option, keeper. Cuts back toward the sideline and is at the 28-yard line. Don't you just see the growth, almost possession by possession for White, just his second collegiate start. Runs out of another tackle, another first down. That's a tightrope that's hard to walk every single week in the SEC. On third and 13, White rolling to the end zone for a nod. Touchdown. Bad White. Bad. So this West Virginia shows they can enough. also score through the air. Mountaineers take over from their own 18, and Slayton was the fake. The run by the quarterback, White. Takes it across the 35. And then everything on the sideline takes them back. White makes one man miss and pack the freshman runs to get another first down. Watch what he does. He's playing with his shoulders a little bit, trying to get the quarterback White to commit. White actually misread it, but has such speed and quickness that he's still able to get up the field. They've already run Kirk on this drive for 58 yards. And here's a White pass. It was a slip screen that was covered, so White makes it up in his own. Pat White inside the 20, inside the 10, to the end zone. Out of bounds, inside the one. This is second and goal, three flags on this drive. White looking for help. Pointing, throwing, end zone, touchdown. Slayton. Two great illustrations of what a quarterback who can improvise, what he can do. Now there's the threat of a defense. They're concerned he's going to take off and run. And a great job by Pat White of getting his eyes downfield. But then he starts to spread people out and run the ball and have a lot of success that way. Second and three. White turns it, runs, and touchdown, West Virginia. Second.
second and seven for West Virginia. Two wins from the BCS. White with room to run. Inside the 10. Brock down at seven. Second and goal from the six. Design run with White to the end zone again. His second rushing touchdown of the night. Still, you compare it to the other BCS conferences, it's unfair to see some of these teams not getting their chance. White was going to throw. Spread everybody out. Takes off. They're very close to field goal range. His memories at Thanksgiving has been practicing for the playoffs in Alabama. Flag down for the offside. White bounced off the first hit and be a very tough, disciplined, reliable player. He's a three and a half year starter. And just threw a block to take White down to the five. And redshirted freshman quarterback Matt White. Ready, snap comes back. Option, Pat gonna keep it. Here comes Pat White to the 40. He's at the 45 to the 50. Here he goes down the field, 40, 35, 30, down the sideline. He's gonna take it all the way for a 65 yard touchdown run. Shotgun formation, Slayton's lone setback. Snap back, handoff goes to Steve. No, they're gonna play action. Here comes Pat White with a big run. White to the 40, to the 45, takes it off the left side. He's at midfield, he may go. The 40 down the far sideline, 30, 25, being cut off. Cuts back to the inside at the 10. Jitterbugs his way across the field. Turns back to his left, he's at the five, and he is heading to the end zone, he's in. It's a touchdown of 77 yard runs. One of the most magnificent runs you will ever see. Quarterback Pat White leaves Bulls in his wake. With 10.53 left here in the fourth quarter, Pat White has exploded for a miraculous touchdown run. He went this way, that way, and back the other way. But most of it's going to be a running play. Now they're going to throw, and there's a strike complete. And a big gain inside the 40 of the 35, Darius Renan. Leading 7-0. They fake it to Slayton. White wants to throw. It does to the end zone. Touchdown. White rolls to his left, doesn't seem like he's intimidated by the Georgia Bulldogs or playing in the dome. White fakes it to Slayton, rolls, wants to throw, and now he'll take off on his own, and he's got it more. Tiptoes out of bounds. Here's second down and nine for the Mountaineers. Their opening drive of the third quarter. White's going to throw a quick one and got it complete to Miles. He came in like uh, 50. 52 percent or something like that 54 percent straight run here not a direct snap and he's in the clear white straight ahead on his own georgia can't bring him down and he gets a first down that is huge second and seven play action white got around one guy and a second and almost a third White going to throw it. Man there. Caught. Touchdown, West Virginia. Second down and long. He'll throw it. Man's there. Touchdown. It's Miles again. In the win over Georgia in the Sugar Bowl last January. So he's got back to backers. White throwing off the wrong foot. Running free. Catch made. Stays on his feet. Down he goes. To overcommit because then they'll check you in the backside. On third and five, White's going to throw his first pass wide open. Touchdown, West Virginia, right on. White keeps it. Has a big crease. Darts inside the 40 of Maryland. This time, White on the keeper. Knifey through the defense. Head White inside the 10. White's got it. And he's got a touchdown. It is a second down and four for the first down, five for the touchdown. White's going to carry, cuts back inside, and did he get in? No. Yes, touchdown! This West Virginia offense. Slayton looking. No, far side kept and in for a touchdown. That is Owen Schmidt. They've got a third down here. Third down and eight, flag is down. Looking deep over the middle, that's gonna be caught. If it's good, it's gonna be a first down up to the 30 yard line. Moses sends the ball back to White, he drops the throw. Pat steps up, he fires a dart downfield and it is caught for the first down. West Virginia's Brandon Miles brings it in in Mississippi State territory at the Bulldogs 45 yard line. Down the middle they went on that play. 
Backs are split and offset. Here's the snap. Play action. Pat White rolls out the left. Pat White running. He's going to keep it heading into the end zone. He's in. Touchdown, Patrick White. Touchdown, West Virginia. And on third down and five, Moses snaps the ball back. Here comes Mississippi State. Pat's going to run with it. Up the middle he goes. He gets a block. He's got the first down of the 35. Cuts back to the outside. Here he goes to the 25, to the 20, running to the corner, being pursued. He's at the 10, to the 5, leaping into the end zone. He is in. A touchdown for Patrick White. A 36-yard spectacular scramble. 46 yards on that keep. And West Virginia is on the board. 27-7 is the score. And here's West Virginia right back. And this one may go to the house. Nobody's going to get him. Touchdown, West Virginia. There's only a couple ways you can defend this freeze option. And sometimes you get the flow way down. You can see the big gashing lanes to the right side. He's got third and fourth effort. It's Patrick White going to keep it. Same play scored on it. Breaks big again. Opening drive, third quarter. White straight up the gut. First down. He's going home. 20, 15, 10. Put six on the board for West Virginia. A 40-yard run by Patrick White. Second and four at the 41. Clock runs with 4.28 to go. Third quarter. White keeps it. Plays work all day. First down and more. Look at Patrick White go inside the 40 to the 36-yard line. First down, West Virginia. A gain of 23 yards. A.J. Brown on the tackle. Second down, five at the 32 of Syracuse. Look at White. Look at this. 20, 15, 10. See you. Touchdown. West Virginia Patrick White. His third rushing touchdown today. 32 yards. And the Mountaineers have a 30 to 14 lead. First and 10 at the 12. Whoa. High snap. Look at this. He breaks a play. To the touchdown. On a high snap, four touchdown runs. Patrick White, 37 14 Mountaineers. What a performance! A 12 yard run. White to throw from his end zone. And he's got an open man, Brandon Miles, with a first down catch out to the 30-yard line. West Virginia offense bounce back against UConn's defense, which has held them to two field goals so far in the game. Slayton, or make that White on the fake, and White is gone inside the 20. Touchdown, West Virginia, on its first play of this drive. A unique look at Saturday's Texas and Nebraska game. Wait till you see who we have reporting. All right, Reese, how about the underappreciated passing ability of White. He goes back to the ground and gets inside the 20 into the 15. A couple of penalties by Connecticut on special teams giving West Virginia excellent starting field position. Something they don't need to excel. And White going deep and Bolden is wide open. Inside the five. Touchdown West Virginia. White over the middle. It's caught. Darius Reyna just grabbed by the shoe. He's got 69 in the night. Most of them coming in that touchdown. White tucks it, runs it to midfield. Jukes waits for a block. Tries to get the corner. Right now, they're in the jet. <laughs> they turned up the tempo. White leading to the end zone. Touchdown. You're seeing Louisville bring some kind of pressure on Pat White. They bring pressure from two guys in this play, but White sidesteps it. Gashes into the defense. He gets clobbered in the secondary at the 40-yard line. Right on to the right of White on third and six. Nice time. Retreats. White has room to run on that sideline. Cuts back first down. Dropped inside the 30. Second and one. White, five yards from a 100-yard game. Will he get it here? Yes. May not in the slot. White is Schmidt out front. Muscles into the end zone. White fires over the middle. Complete for a first down. A huge conversion. Schmidt next to White. He stays in as a blocker. White. 
scampers and now fires downfield. Caught. Miles keeps his feet and gets down inside the five. See if we get over a thousand on this play. Wait. Fakes it and scampers into the end zone. It's over a thousand. As West Virginia faces a third and four. White, he can do it. Big time. Pat White, the quarterback, gets a first down and a whole lot more. And this is a third and 19 for White. Blitz coming. And he gets it off and he completes it. Throwing it very nicely over the defender to Brandon Miles for the Mountaineers. And Pat White finds the end zone. Remember, Maryland rescinded its scholarship offer to him. White airing that one out, looking for the touchdown. The catch is made. What a catch. Brandon Miles, touchdown Mountaineers. Only East Carolina was able to keep him down. Pat White, can he do it by himself? Yes, he can. And that was great to see him involved here early and playing with a lot of emotion and desire. They've run the ball three times for one yard, so White will go deep. Has a man open, it's Slayton with the catch. Five receivers on third and 12. White, trying to make a move and fight for the first down. He's near it up at the 39. Growth really hurt him with a couple of scrambles in that win by USF. And here goes White up the middle. White. Into the secondary and down inside the 40. White fires through an open Darius Reyna. He slips down. Mountaineers three for three on third down so far. White loops it to the end zone. Touchdown. One more time, it's Steve Slayton who reaches the end zone for the second time. This guy can throw the ball, folks. Yeah, yeah. And sets up a third and four. White, a little dart to a man wide open, and it's Raynaud fighting inside the 35. Zone. Shocker. White throw, and there's a man wide open. It's Slayton. He doesn't lose foot races. This is a matchup that Pat White will take every time, and I don't care who's covering Steve Slayton, but how about the throw mm. right over the shoulder again to number 10 for the touchdown? Really sparked this pit team. White, toe looks okay. Gets around the corner, has a crease. Pat White, gone. Pat White from the West Virginia touchdown. How about the triple option? Reed right there, the guy, the defensive end comes down. That tells the quarterback to pull the ball, and this is just magic. This is just, this is just creativity and athletic ability in the open field. Mountaineers looking to build in a four-point lead. White keeps it. White has a crease. White rolls down near the 20. White still got it. He's got a crease, and he's got a touchdown. It is affecting his motion, the way he holds the ball. Now, he actually injured it last season. He thought he could play with it this year, but what the trainers told me is he re-injured it this year, and now he's going to have to get it taken care of. Here, I talked to him last night. He said it. White, still alive, cutting back, first down, wow. He threw for over 200 yards in the first half, and this carry gets him over 200 yards rushing, and this is great running, great athletic ability, and awful tackling by Pitt. Third and 10, high snap, White controls it, going into the corner. They have not really picked on him today, as Coach mentioned. A little pump fake for White. He's going for it all. And he's going for Miles, and he gets him. Owen Schmidt on first down. Patrick White keeps it, comes left. Oh, we have seen them do this so often this year. First and goal. Georgia Tech threatens to blitz. They come. Here's Patrick White. Oh, boy. They really are something to watch. Yep. But it's his neck that's really bothering him. And as Rich Rodriguez said, he's going to try and play. And if not, we will see back of Derek Brown. There's a flag on this play, but the ball is caught by Tito Gonzalez. If the play stands, it's a 57-yard touchdown. Colson remains on the field. 
Patrick White goes in the corner. Miles is there. Caught. Touchdown. And Dan Moses, the All-American center, will snap it back. Patrick White on the keeper. There's the speed. There's the touchdown. I think that was a busted play. Do you really? Yes. Watch, he's going to run the veer, but there's no veer to hand the ball to, so he just keeps it. He stuck it out and just kept it at the same time. And then things have settled yep. down here in the fourth. Here's Patrick White. Nice play, staying in bounds, yes. too. White. First down. This is going to be the first pass, and it's a dandy. Touchdown, West Virginia. Was that the Appalachian State homecoming game? <laughs> well, they're not only going to get a big check, they're going to get a big win. Here's White. Spins away, and he's still on his feet at the 30. Tries to get outside and does. 20, pointing to his blockers. 10, 5, touchdown. What a run. Unbelievable. No flags. 38 yards. Wow. It looked like he was going to be tackled at the line of scrimmage. Mountaineers trying to open it up now here in the third quarter. White on the run. Steps through. There Ten, five. See ya. Clayton has gone all the way at tailback. Here comes the blitz. And he gets away from it. Up the middle. 40. Drag from behind. Stays on his feet. Gets inside the 35. He doesn't panic. He sees the, the blitz coming and just finds a crease. Good broken field running here, and he breaks this tackle. He may take it to the house. White, time to throw, has his man wide open over the middle, and Darius Raymond takes it in for the West Virginia touchdown. And Pat White, one of their Heisman Trophy candidates, hangs on to it. And there's the explosiveness you can expect from White, finally breaking free. And this is the guy right here on this end. That's who he's reading. See, the end closed down, and when the end closes down, the quarterback will pull the football and make magic happen, and that's what Pat White did. 11 carries for 49 yards now for Slate. Another first down now on the 20. And Pat White, he has speed as well. Down run earlier in this quarter. Uh, Steve like Slayton got stronger and Pat White. There are... It's noisy at that end in front of the students. White's got it, and he's got a crease. Pat White into the secondary, into the end zone. Pump fake to Raynaud. Short goes deep. Has a man a double move, and Raynaud hauls it in. Here's White on the keeper. White to the five. Touchdown, Pat White. White fakes to Slayton, one-on-one -on -one with the defender. Look at Pat White! What a move by the quarterback. And it's a touchdown for West Virginia. This city has taken up the cause of University of South Florida football. And they've done their part tonight. First ever sellout for the Bulls at home. White throws it up, and it is caught. Five receivers spread the formation. White, under duress, is going to try to run for it, and he gets it, and much more. Inside the 20. White, it opens up and he gets through it. Maintains his balance. Two tight ends. Fake it to Schmidt. Keeper gonna walk in. Touchdown, Mountaineers. Play fake, little roll out. A lot of options. Renaud is there. Touchdown, West Virginia. This time, Pat White. Fits this football into a tight window just on the inside. Third down and five, 16 yard line. Option, wow. Wow, Patrick White, one leg problem. First down, West Virginia. First possession comes from about the 35 yard line. And it's White all alone at midfield, cuts it back. He's got a chance. 30, 20, 15, touchdown, Patrick White. 64 yards for White. He fooled everybody, Renee. There was nobody close to him. That was great ball handling, and he sold the entire defense that Slayton had the ball. That is his eighth rushing touchdown of the season. Second down and 10 now for West Virginia. Out of the shotgun. There's a quarterback draw. White's got some room. At the 40, gets outside, gets a lead block. 
White looks, throws, cutting in zone, touchdown. White going to keep this all the way. The cutback run inside the 20. He might take it. Rutgers fans come to life as the Mountaineers are back at their own 15-yard line. But White is bringing them out and bringing them in a hurry. Patrick White across the 35. Here they come off the corner. And he will take the quarterback draw straight up the middle. Patrick White to the five-yard line. <laughs> Just leave me alone. Yeah. <laughs> White, quarterback draw, taken off across midfield on his way. And then some. Cuts back outside, inside the 30. Patrick White weaving his way down the field. What a run by number five. Hey, you know, Ness, this guy's been playing for 52 minutes. And he just throws some, he threw moves on these guys that they saw on the very first time he ran the ball in the very first quarter. Look at the people that he fakes out. Now, he, he, the guy's going to really throw. Cardinals show pressure with three men up the middle. White follows a blocker, turns the corner, and gets down inside the 10. White still has it. Looks to the end zone. Wide open for a touchdown is Darius Raynaud. White still has it. Fires. Complete. Touchdown, Raynaud. Number two for number two. On third and five, White rolls out. Throws downfield. Has a man. Leaping catch by Raynaud at the 10. White darts up the middle. Pat White in the open field. Pat White to the house. White, 181 passing and now 147 rushing. Well, and you know what? Louisville's up there and they're trying to really play safe at the defensive line to keep this from happening. But it, what you have to understand is if you're standing still and Pat White starts going, you have no shot of getting an angle to catch him. Watch the safeties. The safeties are looking to bracket receivers and, and the line, and then watch the line. White rolls that way. Schmidt's wide open. White's gonna run it himself. Touchdown. Quite well so far. White. How did he avoid that and throws a perfect strike downfield to Jala? Just a little shake of the shoulder yeah. in Anthony Hoke, who leads the Big East in sacks, went whizzing past. White, quarterback sweep, walks in. Got to take care of your business. Blitz on White, steps inside it. Look out. Still on his feet, Patrick White inside the 20. <laughs> this is exactly what... Rich Rodriguez says is sometimes when you call a pass with a guy like Patrick White, you hope they play man-to-man -man and you hope everybody's covered because that means number five can take off. This time White on the keeper, breaks a tackle. White turtles his way into UConn territory. Second down and 12, White steps back, looks downfield for a big play. To the outside, Reynolds! Inside the 10, hauled down at about the two. So White spreads the field on first and goal, and from the spread keeps it. Reaches for the goal line, he's in. Jasper Howard is a true freshman return man from Miami, and that is a crushing mistake. To the end zone, touchdown, Darius Raynaud. A four-man rush, White escapes. Weaves his way for a first down and more. Patrick White down the sideline. One quick strike for West Virginia and a possible field goal attempt could come. And there's the quick strike. Well, they did a decent job of limiting those big plays on the ground in the first half. As White tries to create one here and does. White gets loose. Only allowing 14.3 points per game. White, they tuck it under. Creates space in the open field. Touchdown! What a cutback at the 15 by White. Well, they might be disappointed as things stand right now, Janine, as White blasts up the middle again. Throws.
comes down a tackler and steps out of bounds. He took Robert McLean and tossed him. First and 17. And again, White keeps it. And again, he makes men miss down the sideline. Tell you what, that is one of the more exciting 16-yard runs I've seen this season. And look at how tough he is. White stays on his feet down the sideline. How does he do it? Tripped up inside the 20. Defenses have different ways of playing this offense, and not many of them are successful. But very evident tonight the Connecticut. And Randy Etzel, their coach, said if they don't turn it over, nobody beats them. They win the national championship. White in trouble. Runs away from it. Pat White with that blazing speed. McKillop edges up as a middle linebacker. White takes off. Blockers in front. First down at the 21-yard line. You don't think this guy is tough? At 185 pounds with a dislocated right thumb. We'll meet the rest of the Mountaineers in a moment. White has room. And White has a first down and much more across midfield. Third and nine. Comes with blitz. And with the empty backfield, here comes Patrick White. First down, Mountaineers across midfield. There's a lot of football left here, and Bob Stoops has been in this situation before in his career. White pumps once, and now he breaks himself free. First down, Mountaineers, and maybe more. Two and a half minutes in the half. White oh, keeps boy. it. He's got a wide open Raynaud. Touchdown, Mountaineers. We are inside of a minute remaining here in the third quarter. Whites across the 30. Cuts it back inside. Pat White at the 40, the 30-yard line. Of the Mountaineers, 377 yards of offense. The home run ball. And there they go! Tito Gonzalez, touchdown Mountaineers! Can you throw it any better than this, Terry? Under duress, Pat White gets knocked down, throws one of those frozen ropes that only Tito Gonzalez is going to catch, breaks a tackle because he's over 200 pounds, and gets in the end zone. Well, the Wildcats had the ball for almost 11 minutes in the opening quarter with no points. Straight drop. White looks down into the end zone. Touchdown! And they'll go out of the I formation. He'll fake it, throw it. They score. Here's that motion. And White, looking deep, has got a man out in front of the field, makes the catch for the touchdown. Motion man, shotgun snap again to White. This time he fakes the hands off, runs out the left side. Here comes Speed, blows up the left sideline. He's got room 25, 20, 15, 10. Hit by Ryan Walters around the ankles and knocked out of bounds. Takes a snap, sets up the pocket. Now runs straight ahead, has room wide open, runs in. Touchdown, West Virginia. Snap to White, pumps, has room right up the middle. Running to his left, gets by Moeller. Running at the 30, 25, 20, 10. One guy back is right, gets by him, five, touchdown. Touchdown, Pat White. 39-yard run by the quarterback, Pat White. He dropped the throw. It was a design throw. But as he dropped back, a big hole opened up in front of him. At the 21 now. Impressive drive for the Mountaineers. White back in at quarterback. Pump fake for the end zone. Jala, touchdown, Mountaineers. Picked up uh, three big third down conversions against Marshall last week as well. Noel Devine. Wide, oh, White. It's complete. Touchdown! Second and 12 for White. On the zone reading, White's got it. White inside Auburn territory. Pat White stumbling over his own man, but he has the first down. You don't think I follow NASCAR? How do you do it, Coach? Amazing. Oh, I just marvel at myself. White going deep. He's got a man. It's a touchdown, West Virginia. Ulrich Garnett and the Mountaineers answer. Mines coming on the blitz. White throwing again. White with a pump fake, looking, plenty of time. Turns on the afterburners, and Pat White, there's a touchdown. That's exactly what the coaching staff for UConn was talking about. This guy can just break it on any play. Well, it looked like a harmless play. It turns into a 24-yard touchdown run escape ability. A little fake, he takes off, 20. 10, 
Another touchdown. That's 91 for number five. You cannot teach speed. Pat White knows how to do that. Put him up, pick him up, and put him down. That was a run the whole way, and Bill Stewart. And he's set to graduate in December, six hours this semester, so he is everything right about college football. Great move by White. There he goes. Right on cue inside the 30. Goodbye. Touchdown, Pat White. His 94th career touchdown. He trails McNabb by only two for number one in Big East history. I think he knew we were having a little conversation up here about him. White waiting and then throwing deep. He's got a man wide open. Caught at the 10 by Arnett. Third down and 10 for Pat White in the West Virginia offense. White with time and he's got a man and he's got a touchdown. Darrell Jala. Well, watch him step into this throw. You're going to get pressure on the outside. He steps up in the pocket and there just knifes it right in. See the eyes here. Watch the eyes of Pat White as he's operating steps up to avoid the pressure. That is right on the money. Beat South Florida and has since lost three in a row and now in danger of missing a bowl for the second straight year. White gets a block inside the 20 yard. And he ties Donovan McNabb for the most touchdowns, the most accounted, touchdowns for accounted for in Big East history. I don't know if he can run with Usain Bolt, but he certainly pulled up a little bit and just saved some for later in the game. Because there nobody was going to catch him. He said, why well, you know, exert any more energy? He's waiting at the front door right now, ringing the doorbell. Play action. White taking off. White touchdown. His fourth that he's accounted for today. So he now is the all-time leader in Big East touchdowns accounted for, yeah. surpassing Donovan McNabb, and he might break Brad Smith's quarterback rushing record before the day is done. <laughs> before we get out of here today. They were uh, harassing Pat White. A lot of the fans were yeah. before the game, and he said, I got your mom, mama. <laughs> and uh, Pat White with a terrific day accounting for four touchdowns, and he's off and running again. And remember, he needs only 25 yards to pass Brad Smith. Not opposed to making a move. White going to throw here, and that pass is perfect. Touchdown, Chuck Sanders. How about the touch on Pat White's throw? Well, this is the difference in Pat White this year. That's at 8 Eastern on ABC. Pat White on the run. And he gets a block. And Pat White slides close to the first down. And oh. White is at 200 yards. So he passes Brad Smith, all-time leading rusher among quarterbacks yeah, just, in college football. Just a smart football player as well. Second and long. And it's the first time we've seen White run. And you see how quickly he can get to top speed. And White gets it down the field to Arnett. Much better on the run than he is within the pocket. Under some heat here, though. He's trying to get it down the field to the tight end, and he goes underneath to Ricky Kovach. A lot of throwing in this half for White. Good looking pass that time. And out in space. West Virginia mediocre on third down so far. Here's a second carry. And Pitts waiting for him. But. White has the escape ability, gets a block, and has a chance! Pat White! He'll score! 54 yards! But look at Pat White. This is one of their 8-10. to 10. That's what they like to have, 8-10 to 10 designed run plays for Pat White. They zone block it, stretch it all the way to the left. And it takes incredible athleticism and vision and ability to cut that football all the way back. And what I love for Pat White, and you see it once he's in the clear, he's at a different speed than the rest of the people. You know right there, there is no one on that football field that is going to catch him. And a quarterback from Daphne, Alabama, the holder of 16 WVU, Big East, and NCAA records, and the nation's all-time quarterback rushing leader, number five, Pat White.
indication that he was hurt before the game. This is a shot we haven't seen him yet in this type of game. Well, they want to throw back, and they do. Got a man open off the goal line. It is caught by Urban. And touchdown, West Virginia. And then he starts coming back across. A, a good job, but this is an excellent throw by Pat White. The safety, excuse me, the corner, Jerome Murphy, was late getting over there. West Virginia leads at 7 0. You can see we have 80 seconds left to play in the opening quarter. And White. They were well schooled on this one. The ball is thrown complete. Jala come out at halftime. McAfee, he was nailing him from 60. He was. <laughs> Here comes pressure. Backside. Now White's going to run. 35 40, 35 at the 30. At the beginning of the season, they run off six in a row to get ball eligible. White throws it complete, trying to break the tackle at the 40. Complete at the 22 to Jack Sanders. Pat White, congratulations on the victory. What does this mean to you personally? Then we'll talk about your team. Um, definitely a great feeling to leave this Mountain Nation with a W. Uh, hey, good shit, man. Matt Grothy, congratulating his fellow quarterback. Let's talk for a moment about Jim Levitt also offering his congratulations. Let's talk for a moment about I watched you on the sidelines there when your defense had to hold at the end of the game. What were you thinking? Huh? They were going to come up with a big play. Good job. And they did. I mean, they, they stopped and they were backed up against the wall, but they came out fighting and got us a victory. Pat, when you look at your career here, what stands out the most? Huh? This last W. This last win is beautiful. Congratulations. Yes, man. sir. Thank you. Thank you. He tried to make something happen, but Bruce Carter on the blitz was on block coming in to make the play. Third down and 11. Just a three man rush for North Carolina. White has an open receiver and a first down. From the 40, White out of the shotgun. Four man rush, lots of time. Trying to run, put the pump fake on Searcy and got by him. First down. Southeastern Conference officiating crew today. Again, four men come after White. He throws a deep strike and what a catch! Touchdown, Ulrich Arnett. Well, let's check it. The footwork good, feet are underneath, eyes downfield. Pat White says, not many people think I can play in the NFL as a quarterback. I'm going to take the big stage on national television and make a case. Yes, I can. Third down and four. White patiently waits for the blocks he needs to get the first down. So that's record number 16 for Patrick White. Three carries, 34 yards for Devine. White faked it to him. Patrick was under duress. Now zings one, has a man, has another touchdown. Bradley starts. It's on target. Little play action, and Pat White does a good job with his feet, not tucking and running, stepping up to buy time. On 15 out of 17. Handles the high snap, pulls it down inside the 15 with a first down. Only one and a half per game. They've had two already today. They rush three this time on third and 13. White has another first down. Another strike to the tight end, Tyler Urban. And a recovery by West Virginia from their own 31. Pat White all day to throw has his receiver. Jock Sanders breaks free to the 29 yard line of North Carolina. That's Dad Bo. Watch the replay. The man they call Chief. Pump fake. White throws a bullet the other way. Touchdown, Mountaineers. All regarding it. Three touchdown passes today for Patrick White. He's thrown for 332 yards. Trying to go out a winner. The question. Started, man. This is for my man B. Hogan 2-2. He down, but he ain't out. We love him. Mountaineer Nation, baby, all day. Yes, sir, B. Hogan, right here. Right here, baby. Pat, your final collegiate game, and it's a career passing day for you. What's going through your body right now? Feel good to leave Mountaineer Nation with a W. Best feeling I've had since I've been there. It just... I love it. I love it. Once a Mountaineer, always a Mountaineer. It's hard to say with your career, what did you prove today? But in, in your mind, what did you prove to a lot of people with this victory and your your personal performance? Well, we proved that we we were down, but we're never out. 
As Mountaineers, we're going to fight to the end. With time left on the clock, we're going to give you everything we got. In a game of big plays, which is the biggest one that stands out with you right now? The kneel down. Best play in college football. <laughs> Pat, congratulations. Thanks, man. Thank you, thank you. For those of you who joined us late, Brandon Hogan, the player to whom he's referring, starting cornerback, did not play today. All the West Virginia folks could tell us is that he's dealing with a personal matter. We don't know any of the details. Rob Stone did his best to ascertain the details, but clearly he is in the thoughts of his teammates and coaches here today. And there's not a prouder dad in America than Bo White Sr. of Daphne, Alabama. What a performance by his son in his last game. Well, a great players play great, great games. This was a great football game, a great setting. And what a way to end a fabulous career. Congratulations, Pat. And I like how we reflected everything on his team. It's all about Mountaineer Nation. What's a Mountaineer? Always a Mountaineer. Well said. Well said. White. Through for 332, by far his career high. He ran for 55 yards, so he came up 26 yards short of rushing for 1,000 for the third year in a row, but he could care less about that.